Good morning. Good morning. Do you have period on my shoulder? We get up at 7 a.m. if you want breakfast at the marina. Otherwise, you can just get up whenever you want. We're going to breakfast at the marina. In the, in the whole <laughs> So it turns out it's because... Um, and where are we going? Asparagus hunting! Just outside the village. This is like two minutes onto the road. Be very, very quiet. We're hunting asparagus. That's what you're looking for. What a asparagus. But it's really tasty and it's really... <gasps> a baby asparagus. Wow. So we gotta find something like that. I didn't see where she picked it though. I mean, this, this is the plant we're looking for, right? I think. Mm -hmm. But I haven't seen any of the little asparagus coming off of it. The asparagus like to grow underneath the olive trees. These are all olive trees. We'll find the elusive asparagus. The hunt is on. I did it. I found one. It's like the smallest asparagus you can possibly imagine. But I found an asparagus. Honey! What? Four asparagus? Oh my gosh. I didn't find these sign I did. I'm sure. holding on to them. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right. I'm still a winner. I've now been imbued with the power of the asparagus. We will find them. Da -da. Da -da -da -da. I can feel it. I can feel it. Oh, indeed. The power of the asparagus is mine. I found my first asparagus! Here he is, in this little pokey bush. Fresh asparagus. Wild. Wild, wild west. Wild, wild asparagus. <laughs> I'm gonna rip it on my teeth. Oh my gosh, that's so hard to find. Look at that. Seriously. I found another one! They're really little, and you've got to just see them poking out. See them? Right there. Okay, I don't know a lot about asparagus, or plants in general, but I'm sort of inferring a bit here. So this is an asparagus plant. I'm not going to pick it because it's really hard and woody. It's growing now. Right? It's actually getting the little buds. It's turning into more of a woody plant than this kind of soft fibrous one. So after it sort of grows, it turns into this spiky, pokey plant, which is really hard. Um, so this is like, you know, stage one, stage two, stage three. And, you know, we have like really fat asparagus that we buy at the supermarket. And this is like really thin, long stuff. So I'd imagine just like pruning a tree, they would probably pick the buds off or something sort of stunt their growth so they grow nice thick and fat but still maintain that squishy fibrous bit that we all enjoy when eating asparagus. So that's my sort of learning for the day I guess is asparagus. Right Bonnie? Yeah! And go! Hunters. Everybody work together. Her buddy and the dogs. Gonna be honest with you. Last work away, I was called out for um, when I concentrate sticking my tongue out, and you know where I got it? My dad. My dad does it too. When you concentrate, you just put your tongue out. It just is what happens, and I can't even help it. I know some of you do it. Don't try to deny it. Sticking the tongue out thing while you're concentrating is a thing. It just happens. Some people have it, some don't. Don't make fun of the people that do it. So, my secret that I'm going to share with you is the mask. No one else knows that while I'm working, I have my tongue out. Can't even tell. That's my secret. I've been sticking my tongue out this whole time. Nobody knew. It's a fact. You get more work done when your mouth's open and your tongue's out. How are you cooking our asparagus we picked? We just 
I don't know the word, but blanche. Mm -hmm. Then I cut it, put it into the sauce, which I prepare Ooh. from uh, olive oil, slightly crushed garlic, uh, panacetta, panacetta. Ah, panacetta, and mm -hmm. onion. And we had uh, heads of mm -hmm. asparagus, which I want blanche because they are very soft and mm. uh, they are delicious right now. Have one. <laughs> 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 mm. Oh my gosh, this looks so good. <laughs>